I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you the questions from my student Manvi. Manvi thanks a lot for sharing these questions and I hope many many of my subscribers will benefit from their solution. Now here's the very first one it says uh, use the digits 1 to 4 once to make this equation true. Uh, I'll rewrite this equation as there's some typing error or it's not very clear. So what we have here is four blank spaces. This is one blank space. For example, it's written as something over six plus blank space on the top over five plus blank space on top and bottom is equals to 49 over 30 right so that's the that's the question and in these blank spaces we have to fill in numbers from 1 to 4 we are filling numbers from 1 to 4 right these numbers cannot be repeated so 1 2 3 4 spaces to be filled with numbers 1 to 4 so that once we add these three fractions what we get is 49 over 30. So that is the question which Manvi wants to understand how to answer. So let's look into this question and understand the strategy. We are looking for placing numbers like 1, 2, 3 or 4 here. Now let's look into the denominator. 30. 6 times 5 is 30. So in the denominator if I place 1, it is no more a fraction like this. If I place 2, I could because 2 is a factor of 30, but I can also place 3. So I have a co combination. I could use 2 or 3. So we can try with either one of them, right? So for the time being, I will use the number 3. I could have tried both, right? So, so let's say we use 3 here. Now if I use 3 here, in this particular case I do get the common denominator of 30 now how do I get the numbers in the numerator so that we get 49 over 30 so what I will do here is I will rewrite the given expression and then I'll show you my strategy so what we have here for the time being is we are taking this as 6 as given to us 5 and 3 now, if I have common denominator of 30, how will I get that? I have to multiply this by 5, correct? I have to times this by 5 to get 30, right? So, 5 times some number. And here it is 5 times 6, which will give me 30. Here I have 6 times some number. And 6 times 5 is going to give me 30. In this case, I can multiply this by 10. So, I'll say some number times 10. Okay. So I have to multiply both numerator and denominator by the same number to get common denominator. So what we are trying to do here is to get common denominator. Right? Only when you have common denominator you can add fractions. So that is the strategy. Now it is simpler to understand what three numbers which are now for us 1, 2 and 4. How should they be placed here so that we get 49? Okay. Now look at this part. 9. Let's look at 9. 9. How do we get 9? Now with this combination, you could get 5 plus 4 is 9. Right? 5 plus 4 is 9. We say 5 plus 4 is 9. And this is at 1's place. So what we can do here is we can place... 1 here so we get 5 in units place and then we can place how do we get 4 6 times 4 is 24 right 6 times 4 is 24 so 4 plus 5 is 9 okay so we have already got 24 and 5 which is 29 and once we have placed this we are left with 2 we can place 2 here and check our answer Right, so what do we see here? We have 5 over 30 plus 24 over 30 plus 20 
over 30 and that is indeed denominator is 30 common denominator 20 plus 24 is 44 plus 5 is 49 do you understand how we approach the answer so what we found is that we could place 1 here 4 in this place 2 here and 3 there to get our answer I hope this strategy helps you to get the solution by logic. I'm Anil Kumar and this strategy which I'm sharing with you should help you to solve many such questions. Thank you once again Manvi for sharing this question. Thanks to all my subscribers for watching. You can always share and subscribe my videos and feel free to post questions. Thank you.